In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a complete setup of your Epson EcoTank ET3830 printer. Let's start with the unboxing. Press the power button. Now go to the printer screen. Select your language. Press OK. Now you can start the setup process with the mobile phone. Or if you don't want to use any mobile or any app right now, then you can just click on the continue setup without app. So click OK. Press OK. Next thing is to fill in the ink tanks. So click OK to start that. To access the ink chamber, place your hand on the side and lift this door. And now we can open it. Here we have to install the ink. So let's start with the black. And you simply have to place it here facing downwards and let the ink go. Once the ink is filled in, shake it and take it out. So once you fill in the ink, close this lock. Now open the next. Remove the bottle cap and place it here. Once it's done, we can take the bottle out. Now close the cap, open the next one. Now close it, open the last one. Shake the water a little bit and take it out. Now we can close it and also close the ink door. After filling the ink tanks, close this chamber and press the door down. Now go to the screen. On the screen, click on the proceed button. So select OK. Now press and hold this button for 5 seconds. And click on the start button. Now wait for the ink system to start. It will take around 10 minutes. Next thing is to do the print quality adjustment. So click OK. Now click on the adjust that is recommended. Now also click on the print button. Next thing is to load the paper. So we can load it at the bottom tray. So slide it out. Adjust the size from here. Now slide it in and close it go to the screen and click on the print button this is the paper output tray we can slide it out now on the pages we have to select if everything is okay and once it's okay then we can just click okay again on the next page it will show up like hash one hash two detail so whatever the best line is just enter it there on the next printout we have to select boxes so select the best boxes and enter on the screen there are four alignment patterns now we have to select the correct lines select the paper size and then click on the done button so printer is almost ready we can start using it for copy to do wireless printing and scanning we need to connect it with the wi-fi network of our home or office so go to the printer control panel now scroll ahead and look for the four settings click journal settings go down network settings wi-fi setup wi-fi recommended start setup wi-fi setup wizard select your wi-fi network and enter the password the password can be entered using this panel enter the password and then start the setup so it's connected to the Wi-Fi network click on the close go to the home button next thing is to add in a device for wireless printing or scanning 
so I'm going to use my iPhone. Download the Epson iPrint app. In this app, we have to add the printer. So select the top button. Now select this home screen. Once you see your printer, click here. Select keep using Epson iPrint. Instantly the printer will add up here and it will display all the details. Now go to the home button. Now we are ready for the wireless printing and scanning. So this way we can do the complete setup. Now for printing simply select a document. So select any document and click on the print button. So it will give a confirmation like if it's printing or not. So this way we can do the complete setup and we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning. Thanks for watching.